At Suffolk, we have a significant transfer population. It's close to 20% of our population. So when they come in, we have a transfer specific orientation. We have one-on-one -on -one advising appointments that you can set up both virtually or in person. So we try to make, once again, the, the transition as seamless as possible um, by creating that individualized atmosphere. I was able to reach out to the transfer admissions representative. So they have a special like kind of academy called Ram Academy, where you're able to get here early, feel around the city. You're able to kind of still like meet some other transfers, meet some first year students as well, and then gain leadership opportunities in that specific Ram Academy. Um, they're still pushing you and having you kind of go to these orientation events, let that be convocation. So, you know, you still feel a part of that school during that first kind of like welcome. You're still going to, you know, those welcome nights, those welcome events that Suffolk puts on. So they're doing a great job at kind of making sure you still feel like connected and welcome to Suffolk. I transferred to Suffolk um, because I grew up in Boston. I'm from Dorchester originally. The columns at Sergeant Hall is what attracted me to Suffolk. I've always remembered those columns as a kid, walking through Tremont Street on, on our way to the commons with my mom, my family. Um, and they've always stood out to me. They remain an icon um, as to what a university will, will look like. So as I navigated through my career in the military, I knew I wanted to come back to, back home to Suffolk University.